Hello everyone, this is Phoenix Animator. Hi, I'm Froggy Lumpy. Welcome back to Sky Factory 3. We're on episode 11. Good grief, you have googly eyes again. I know, I'm getting lucky. <laughs> <laughs> um, we're still working on the chickens. Uh, lots of work there to be done. Lots yeah. of breeding, lots of babies, lots yeah. of interchanging and all that. But we're going to switch it back over here to the mystical agriculture because... We need to get some more power going, and we want that culinary generator going with an easy recipe. Yes. Large meals do better things, although I don't know exactly what the bacon and eggs actually does as far as energy goes. But Let's it is a large see. meal. So I was thinking bacon. making bacon and eggs because they're so easy. 96,000 RF at 72 RF per tick. Well, that's not too bad. That's not too bad. Here's the biggest reason why I decided to do bacon and eggs. We're getting an enormous amount of eggs over there, right? We are. Our chickens it's are just, just ridiculous. Eggs for days. So, instead of just tossing these eggs and throwing them away, of course, you want to selectively take the eggs out that are the best growth eggs and use those to breed with. But yes. then what do you do with the other hundred eggs you have? Turn them you know? into omelets. Turn them into bacon and eggs. And I was wondering, will it accept the different colored eggs? And it does. That's wonderful. So, that's what made me think, okay, this is fabulous. Then I'll make a pork seed. Yep. And then the essence will make the, the pork. So that way we don't have to kill a bunch of pigs. Because really that's your, that's your other option. Do what? I said, is it really pork if it's a plant growing it? Wouldn't it be more like tofu at that point? You know, you do have a point. It is like tofu pork, isn't it? Yep. <laughs> but anyway, this this way we can get the pork chops that we need for the bacon and eggs. But the only thing you need is the 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 pork, the egg, and then a skillet. And so it's a real easy recipe. And it's a real good way to get rid of your all of those eggs instead of throwing them away. You can use them and put them in your culinary generator, creating new power. Put that power into like a capacitor to save it, to store it, or you know whatever you choose. But I thought, okay, let's do that then. So I've made three of these uh, these pig chunks. I needed one more, so I had to go make uh, make a few more babies. Uh -huh. um, so I have to pull this out of here, though, so I can make the actual fourth one. Which you need a mob uh, tier two mob chunk. Let's just review this since it is new. Okay, the recipe for the tier two is a tier one mob chunk. Tier one mob chunk is taking the zombie chunks, throw them in the furnace, and they become a tier one mob chunk. Okay. Then place the Prudentium Essence, two of those left and right here, and you'll get your Mob 2 chunk to get your Prudentium Essence. That is easy. You just need the the first stage, Inferium Essence, four of those around your Infusion Crystal, and that will get you one Prudentium. So, as I've stated in previous episodes, your stack of Inferium is four times less than at the end result. You end up with like four or eight, depending upon how far up the chain you go, you can end up with one. Uh, because you're going up the chain, you're going from Inferium to Prudentium, Prudentium to Intermedium, Intermedium to su su Superium. And actually, you, one stack will not get you um, all the way up to uh, Supremium. You can't even get that far. You only get to the Intermedium. Anyway, oh. uh, you might, I'm sorry, you might get to one Supremium. Super, well, if, if it's like Supremium. Supremium. If it's like uh, the um, um, magical crops, then it takes four stacks to make one. Yeah, exactly. You, But but it does. It's one um, supreme, not the supremium. You have to get the. You have, it takes more than that to get to the supremium stage. Um, that was the one that I had not made um, back when I did that episode. 
Yep. Anyway, back to the pig chuck. Okay, we got four raw pork chops and the mob two tear chunks. So now we have the fourth one finally. So Yay. let's put these all four in here. Yep. And we'll put the four Prudentium. Prudentium. And then we also need the tier two crafting seed. Now the tier two crafting seed, how do you get that recipe? You need the tier one crafting seed with the Prudentium surrounding it. So you'll need four Prudentium there. To get a tier one crafting seed, let's get the recipe for that. Now you need your basic Inferium essence with your base crafting seed. That'll get you step one. Of course, now to get step one, you need the base crafting seed and the recipe to that is a regular Minecraft seed surrounded by four Prosperity Shards, which you get from Sieving Sand. So, in an iron mesh or a diamond mesh. Yes, and honestly, I did both of those because our thing over here is actually right side by side. And right. I had a bunch of sand, so I put two in here and two in here and two in here, and I was doing this, right? Yep. Not all because it'll do, it'll, you click once and it'll do two because they're side by side. As long as right. these are attached together in any number, they will. You just click once and it'll, and it'll put them in both or all three or whatever. You could have a five by five set here and it would do it. But honestly, the the difference in the ratio is a slight bit of difference. But I actually thought I got more out of it in the iron than I did the diamond. Interesting. Oh, wow. So yeah, I got like twenty something of them. Um, I think it was how many? Did, how many's in here now? Oh. There's, There's like eight. 42. So yeah, it was like 20. It was at least 20 something that I got. I have 42 of them. Cool. Now. So, but anyway, pig seed. Pig seed. Okay, I took up a fire seed. Uh, you as did. you can see, I put some ucky water in here. Um, we got liquid fertilizer. I'm thinking that it might help. I don't actually know that to be true, but it's but it seemed like that wheat over there was grown. The one that was right by that water grew faster. I don't know, but I did fertilize all this dirt here, and these are all growing a lot faster. Oh yeah. So let's go ahead and place our pig crop down here. Okay. The other thing I wanted to show before I turn it over to you, and you can have the rest of the episode. Uh huh. Is the whole point in this is to be able to gain some more power quickly so i just wanted to show because i do have one more pork job cool you can place this and i'm using one of the the uh red eggs right yes put your skillet up here in the corner right you can put your egg and your pork chop in any one of these spots here okay here's a bone white chicken egg let's swap it out see bone white chicken egg will work too that's why i was like oh this is fabulous bacon eggs is great and see it's a large meal so you could actually use this for your own self and you'll have total saturation and give you five chicken chunks total saturation so it's a really good meal and it's really easy because you you're getting hundreds of eggs from all these chickens uh, so it makes it really great just make this either do a pig farm or do a pig seed and then what we're going to do is set up an auto an automation it takes three essences and so i'm gonna i'm gonna set an automation up for that and then eventually we'll pull this all into automation um into the system and right straight to the culinary generator i don't know so that'll be fabulous he's already grown 29 percent. yep so what do you have for us well i oh, there you go again. It, it glowed oh it glowed but it didn't grow yeah maybe, maybe it was this one fire crop well, now yeah. it's a 43 percent Oh. Maybe it was just delayed. Yeah. I wanted to try something. What are you going to try? I don't know about you, but I'm tired of picking up poop. Well, yeah. Do you got something that will actually collect that? I'm thinking. I'm hoping. I'm hoping I have something. With an ender pearl, a hopper, and three obsidian, I'm going to make an item collector from random things. Okay. And if we come over here to our farm, by the way, I added a carpet to the edge here. It's oh, the same thank you. process. Fabulous. Thank you. We can walk across this now. Now what I'm going to do is I'm going to place on the back side here a okay. basic drawer okay. with poop. 
<laughs> and a void upgrade. And I'm going to put the item collector on top. Oh my gosh, it worked because they all disappeared. It didn't get that poop over there, though. Okay, it's manure. <laughs> it's poop. <laughs> um, okay, but it got a lot of it, though, so that's fabulous. It gets the bulk of it. That is, yes, it, that. That's most of it. So that's maybe if we great. put a fence on that blue line okay, over there, I don't we think can... we need to worry about one little piece of it. Boop. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> you um, pushed me. I did really. It yep. worked. Oh wow, that's amazing. You pushed me in. I pushed you into the into the thing. Uh, since you came over here, look at um, our friends. We we have friends. Are they are they producing what we want? Nope. No, they're not. A yellow chicken. You two and need to get friendlier with each other. A yellow chicken and an iron chicken. Okay, now both of these are three. Uh, this one did though. So maybe we can. Oh, really? Oh, fast. A sand egg. You got sand it chicken. then. Oh, look you there. Check it out. Redstone chicken. And egg. more poop. And it's a four 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 in its growth gain and strength. That is fabulous. And what about this guy? Does he have anything? Nope. Okay. I didn't want to set the automation thing up like we have over here. What are you doing? Digging. I have it set up to where they go into this. Cool. They all go into here. That hopper goes into this hopper, and then this hopper goes into this chest. And you have to make sure the hopper ends are actually facing what you're wanting yep. for that to actually work. Exactly. So there we go. So our next stage is uh, has arrived. Look, we have a redstone chicken. So let's put it in. Um, there we go. The heat lamp. And we'll have a redstone chicken soon. And cool. I haven't finished the house, the, the hen house, the chicken coop, whatever you want to call it, yet. We had a little bit of problem signing on. We did. We we had. We almost uh, thought we wouldn't be able to record today. We had authentic. The uh, the authenticity was not uh, showing up, and we thought the servers were down. Turned out it was our internet that was down. User error. Yeah. Okay. So so the next thing I'm gonna do, and I'm not gonna show all of this. Um, I'm actually just gonna start it, but I figure I'd do the starting part because that's the scary part. I'm going to build another platform a little bit lower for being able to make squids and bats. Yes, and that's one of the uh, quest um, achievements is making a to make a platform lower. below your platform. Yep. Okay, so, so I'll just stand here and watch. You go on down there and do that. Okay. Have fun. Thanks. Be careful. Please don't get hurt. Wow, 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 wow. Off you go. Off I go. Oh, there's squid, too. <laughs> it's so funny how they'll they'll spawn in the water, and then, of course, they, you know, go to swim out and die. Oh, oh. You need a little air. Got it. Come out for some fresh air. Gotta come back up. I'm too low. Okay, so I need to be about where I'm at now. So, that's... Not low enough. Two, three. Okay, so where I'm at now, that's the bottom. Squid will only spawn in 63 two, and two. below. Yep. And bats are um, also around 63 and below, but in dark areas. Yes. So now we can come over here and up. There we go. I made it! Yay! Yay, you're on a little ledge. Make sure to light it up. I will. I brought torches with me. Oh, very good. So there we go. There's that. Aren't you wonderful audience loving this view? Um, of, it's kind of weird. Nothing look. below me. It's kind of strange looking from my point of view. Yeah? Uh, because you're little and... I'm seeing stars, and it's just, it's <laughs> kind of weird. Yep. Just, just nothing. Yeah, it's... I almost look like I'm looking up, which is really weird when you think of it that way. 
Yeah, because you're I'm looking down and seeing all those little stars. Crazy. There we go. And now I'll place another torch and then we'll do F7 to check our lighting. And down here, but this And in I the cannot middle. see any X's from way up here either. Oh, that's good. Okay, so now why are you making it all solid there? Because this is the pool. This is so this is the bottom floor? Yep. Oh. This is the bottom of the of the pool. Are you gonna let that be? Are you gonna um, put walls up then? Yep. And let the the fountain fill it in. Exactly. Or are you gonna get rid of it? No, I'm gonna let the fountain fill it in. But I'm gonna I'm like I said I'm gonna build it off. There's that oh, starting point. It's all set. So all you can do is put walls up. Yep, put up some walls and put up the, uh, and let the, and then fill, finish filling in the water and I'm all set to go. And then we can get squid and I can get a squid seed. And we can also get bats because we need bats for other things too. Yes. Oh look, there's squid already. So. Oh my gosh, go down there and get him. <laughs> oh my goodness. Oh, That's what I was the, meaning We needed about the squid itself though. How they spawn, um, yeah. Well, yeah, oh gosh, I would have killed myself here. Don't do that. Um, I have a, here, I have a gold, uh-oh, there we go, golden lasso. I don't know if he'll still be there, we'll see. I'm not going over there, because I, I almost. Oh my goodness, there's a bunch of them. Almost Geronimo! Walked, almost walked off the edge. They can't, they can't get through the, through the rocks. We actually need a live squid so that we can... I'll save you! So that we, we can turn that squid into a gas. Is that correct? We need... Yes. Exactly. That's what we need the squid for. Because you put squid in witch water and that gets you a gas. And we need the gas we so that we can get and we have witch water right our here. rings. So, how do we capture the gas, though? Do, oh, we need to make a little house yep that has witch water in it yes okay and then we can put the squid in the witch water yep but we'll have that pond down there that we can go to in case we need to get more that sounds wonderful yep all righty then so there we go we have a squid now so we can do this that's great exactly and oh look ink sacks thank you we are, you're welcome we're short on ink they killed themselves did they yep oh no poor poor guys committed suicide Okay, so we're we're advancing our our uh, mobs because we're doing fake pigs, sort of a half tofu and a half <laughs> <laughs> pork chop pig. But at least we're doing it the humane way. We're not killing pigs, right? Exactly. Um, and then we're advancing our chickens with our redstone uh, our redstone chicken. Now, where do you go, red red chicken? Uh, where did my redstone You chicken... put it in the nest, didn't you? Yo, oh, yes, I did. Thank you. <laughs> Scared myself. Yep. Um, he, he's actually probably hatched by now. Not yet. Um, next thing we, do, we have to do is go to the nether so that we can get another quartz chicken. Because that's the only way to get another quartz chicken. Is go to the nether, build a platform, and wait. Yes, I would like to try to get the uh, flight before we do that. Yes, that means we need jetpacks. Yep. So we'll keep working on our animals and getting them built up to produce more stuff. I don't know, because there's a few other ones that we can do. The other chicken that we're working on is actually the gold chicken, which we just got too. Uh, we have a gold chicken egg. Oh, fabulous! Okay, I'm pulling that out. We're gonna, we're gonna, um, we're gonna hatch that. Um, he's yeah, the redstone is about to hatch. Cool. So, so fabulous! These guys are gonna go into the into the um, chicken coop and uh, in house, um, and hopefully I'll be able to finish building that house. So why are you throwing cobblestone on the ground? I wanted to see if the random thing was picking it up. No, it won't because there's not enough room. I wanted to make sure. Uh, because all the slots are full. Yep. It won't. Alright, well, there's a redstone chicken. Yay! 
Where'd he go? He's, he's by the Donald. Oh, there Donald, he is. Donald, oh, Donald. look at him. Isn't he cute? Yep. Oh, look at ya. Welcome. <laughs> welcome. Welcome, welcome, welcome. Welcome to the end of the episode. All right. I'm Froggy Lumpy. And I'm Phoenix Animator. Thanks ever so much for watching, everybody. This is turning into a chicken sky block. It is. It seems like, because... We have a huge amount of chickens, and I'm not. We haven't even started, really. We have. I mean, because we've got an enormous amount to do. We so. do. Have a great day. Thanks ever so much for watching, everybody. Bye. Hope you enjoyed the episode. And if you have any suggestions, leave them in the comments below. Bye. Bye. See you all later. We got. We got to. I got to get busy working on the house and, and seal it up. Exactly. Put a roof on. Exactly. Bye. Bye. Wow, wow, wow.